In this video, I'll show you how to enable a single page registration in MemberPress. And as always, be sure to like and subscribe for all of our latest tips and tricks on running your membership site. Okay, for this video, I have this sample site here. If I go to sign up at the top, you can see that I have two memberships people can buy. I'll click sign up under my basic membership, and I'll be taken to its registration page, which looks like this. To show you this process, I'll start registering with some fake testing data, a first name, last name, username, email, password, and here you can see the two payment gateways I have set up in my member press settings. I'll go ahead and choose credit card, then click sign up. Then on the next page, I'll see the payment terms and have a spot to enter my credit card. I'll go ahead and enter a test credit card number and expiration date and security code and a random zip code and I'll click sign up again. Then once the registration is complete, I'll be taken to my thank you page. Now, there is a way to combine both of the pages, the first with the name, username, password, etc., and the payment info page all into one. This gives the users less steps to sign up and makes the registration process a bit simpler. Now, you may want to keep the two-page sign up for a few reasons. One, being able to send a reminder email out to users who abandoned the sign up. So, if someone enters their email and other personal info on the first page of your registration, but they ditch out on the second page with the payment info, you can send them an email a day later, for example, giving them a nudge or incentive to come back to your site and complete the signup. See your knowledge base for more information on MemberPress reminders. But I want to make my registration page one page only. So I'll exit this incognito window and go back to my WordPress dashboard. Then I'll go to MemberPress, Settings, and the Account tab. Here under Registration, you'll see two options. Enable Single Page Checkout and Enable Single Page Checkout Invoice. The first, Enable Single Page Checkout, will put your entire registration process on one page. So to show you, I'll check to enable it and click Update Options here at the bottom. Now I'll open my site in a new incognito window so I'm not logged in as my admin user. Then I'll go to Sign Up and click the Sign Up for my basic membership. And here, you can see the payment options right here under the other fields, all on one page. Now, I'll minimize this incognito window and go back to my MemberPress settings. The second option, Enable Single Page Checkout Invoice, will display an invoice table above the payment options on the registration page. I'll enable that and click Update Options. Now, I'll go back to that incognito window and hit Refresh. And now I can see my single page registration with the checkout invoice here. In general, providing an itemized invoice is often a good practice so people can see their exact total before purchasing. In the EU, for example, regulations require a user to be shown an itemized breakdown for their payment, including subtotal, taxes, and total, prior to payments being collected. That being said, it's generally always a good idea to provide this breakdown by enabling this invoice. I'll go ahead and sign up with some fake testing data, name, username, email, password, and enter a test credit card number. Then I'll click sign up. Then I'm taken to my thank you page, so you can see the registration process happened all on one page. You've now seen how to enable a single page checkout in MemberPress. Thanks for watching. If you liked the video, be sure to like, subscribe, and check out our other videos that makes getting MemberPress up and running a breeze.